you know, lactose free milk is given an enzyme that uh, lactase, you know, for people that are, that are lacking in lactase, they put that in the milk and that breaks that bond. So lactose is a disaccharide. So that's two carbohydrates bonded together. So glucose and galactose bonded together. Some people can't break that bond. And so that goes into our colon where our bacteria are, and they can certainly break that bond and they can eat that. And they produce gas and bloating and swelling and discomfort and all that sort of stuff. And sometimes diarrhea and, and uh, a lot of gas. And so, you know, that's what people with lactose intolerance, you know, experience. So if you are um, drinking lactose free milk, what they do is they put that lactase enzyme in there and it just breaks that bond. And so now you just have glucose, free floating glucose and lactose which your body can then absorb. So you're still getting carbs, right? So having having some milk occasionally, whether it's lactose free or not lactose free, if you if you are able to make lactase, uh, is is okay. But I mean, people will hear that and go, great, and they're just gonna drink a whole bunch of milk. Don't do that. You know, there's enough, there's enough uh, carbs in there that it's gonna raise your, your insulin level. And it's going to raise your blood sugar, raise your insulin. And that ins high insulin is going to kick you out of uh, metabolic ketosis. Certainly, it's just going to disrupt your normal workings. You don't want your, your insulin high. You know, you don't want your blood sugar high. It, past physiological levels of, of blood sugar, carbs are a toxin. They, they cause direct damage to your body. And your body responds to detoxify this quickly by raising your insulin, right? So this is not good. You know, well, what about kids? Why do they drink it? Kids stay in ketosis when they're drinking breast milk. Not everyone knows that, but they do because kids are much, much easier. They're much easier to get into ketosis. Then you start taking, put them on formula, just a bunch of sugar and crap, and maybe their, their ketosis isn't, isn't uh, aren't able to stay in it, but they can get into ketosis much easier. Now as an adult, it takes 24 hours usually uh, to get just start getting into ketosis. And then that probably a couple of days to get into deep ketosis. Kids are much quicker because it's vital for them to be in ketosis because that's when their brain is growing the most. And you, you need those ketones to get into the brain to fuel the brain. People say that, that you need glucose to feed the brain. Nonsense. They do not understand biochemistry or normal physiology. I don't care if they're a professor or anyone else. They don't know what they're talking about. Um, your brain preferentially runs on ketones. Why do I say that? Because even if you have high blood sugar, if you have any ketones, your brain is running on those ketones and that's filling the gaps with the glucose. And as the ketones come up, your body starts using less and less and less and less blood sugar until finally when you have enough ketones, your brain just goes, right, this is all we're using. It doesn't matter how high. You could have all the blood sugar in the world. You, if you have enough ketones, your brain will only run on the ketones. That shows preference. Your brain preferentially runs on ketones. And those ketones cross the blood brain barrier, get into the brain, reconstitute into fatty acids, right? So you break down fatty acids, turn those into ketones. Those are the energy sources circulating throughout the body that our cells use in, in the mitochondria. And that can cross into the blood brain barrier and they can actually reform into fat. Those make up the building blocks of physical structures of your brain as well. So when you're trying to build a brain and put on mass, of, of brain, 70% of your brain is fat. You know, where do you think that's coming from? It's coming from, you know, your body, your ketones and, and your diet and things like that. So you need this stuff.